We were not born for life in the tunnels. I was born to breathe fresh air, and I remember.
They're coming back. Attention, people. Oh, look, it's the hero. More delightful. It's nighttime at the station. Don't worry. I told you. I, I got it. I got it. Don't open up. Go. said you'll be fine. Are you trying to kill me with worry? What if next time you don't return from the surface? There's no one out there, Artyom. No one to find, no one to talk to. If there was, don't you think they'd be here already? We've talked about this again and again. You have to accept it. There's only us. Colonel! Hello, Alex. There you are, you stubborn fool. How many times are we going to have this conversation? I don't care if you kill yourself over this silly dream of yours. But don't you see what you're doing to my daughter? Your wife? Dad, please. The order is short on men after the battle for D6. But you leave. People need you. And you pursue your selfish obsession. But now this shit has to stop! There's only Metro, nothing else! And the Order is here to defend it! Because if not us, then who? You look fine to me, so get ready to go. Then we'll discuss your transfer to Polis. Come, we need to talk. I'll get the doctor. Artyom, please, promise me this was the last time. I'll see you later. Artyom, we managed to bring you back from the brink, but people are giving you their blood, which could save so many wounded, and you keep bringing it back irradiated. Don't you think that is unfair? Let me put it this way. I can't promise I'll be able to bring you back next time. Still, lucky those Spartans are the good. They brought Artyom here just in time. They sure are. I cannot remember the last time I saw a bunch of healthy and fit people down here. Nah, me neither. It's a shame they spend so much time on the surface. Eh, well, sadly, it's their job. <laughs> job or no job, if they keep doing that. Well, not everyone can stand being cooped up down here. <coughs> huh? And why not? It's what's kept us alive until now. How many times already? How long do you think that's going to last? How many kids are there in the station? I left the order, and now nobody gets to decide for me. Alpha, no! Oh, I can't believe my eyes! Artyom! You're all right. You gave us a scare, brother. Artyom! How are you, friend? I see Pardon you, all me, right. gentlemen, give way! This calls for a celebration. Artyom. A few more scars and you will be completely irresistible to any woman. Speaking of which... Hello, how you are you in your hospital, guys, huh? Could you just stop crowding him? Brother. Welcome back, Artyom. Ah, uh, Privyat, Artyom. All right, you're all dismissed. I give you two hours, people. 
Yeah! yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. it's official. Yeah. I knew it. You guys are like, so yes. I brought something. And here we go again. <laughs> Please, let's not repeat the last Hold time. Hold on, Artyom. Because it's dead. We took our time. Time to replace our filters. Move it. We don't need any extra radiation, darling. Oh, Father will kill me if he finds out I went up with you. Twice if he learns we've been to a Hansa off-limit zone. Have you been to all of these ruins? <sighs> See all the destruction. And Moscow had the best anti-air defenses in the country. If this is how it looks now, imagine how the rest of the world looks. There's just no way anything can live up here with monsters. Look, maybe you should come back to the Order. We'll move to Polis. Dad says he'll arrange a flat for us. Because if not us, then who? A flat with a kitchen and a shower. Let's go, it turns here. It's not stable enough. Careful. At least it held. zone is off limit I mean if all the packs here are like that to cross the railroad. It would save us a detour. Damn, too high. Hey, Hatyam, help me get out there. Shh. 
Should have checked first, assholes. Artyom, thank God. These people, they're Hansa, not the Order. Assholes. They did a number on you. Well, Dad will rip them a new one for that. What's going on in this Moscow of yours, anyways? Of yours? You're putting this like you're not from here. We aren't. Our village is about 200 kilometers from here. What village? You're not from Moscow? Just a regular village. We came here to find the boy's father. Left for Moscow about a year ago and never came back. But then we got caught by this here. You mean there's life outside? Why wouldn't there be any? Sure, there are lots of bad places and lots of beasts around, but we still get by. Artyom, you were right. People really do live out there. We didn't know. We thought we were the only survivors. God, we'll tell the whole Metro about this. The heck and the boy out! Hey, you people drove us halfway to nowhere. They can handle it. At least give them their masks back. Let's go. 
watchmen broke through. <sighs> Workers done for. Keep your weapon trained on the opening. If anything comes through, shoot. Attention! The turntable is switching on! this shit again, okay? to the base chief for interrogation. I can't take you to the main entrance. Too many guards. But we may sneak in from the back. Let's go. Don't rush, though. If they notice you, we're both done for. Wait. You'd better not walk into the light. Let's do it this way. You sneak to the lighting panel and disable it while I distract them.
Come on, Walter. Wait. Great. Now throw it. I hope the noise distracts him. are coming through. Here, quick! Let's go! Who are you? Andrei Ivanovich Yerbeck, the train engineer. Run now! Just get to that hangar, then God willing, I'll get you out of here. They know me, so I'll get there easily. Why are you helping us, Andrei Ivanovich? I had... Uh, ah, I guess I'll tell you later. I hope. Hey guys, Be careful. Artyom, I see the enemy. <sighs> Give me a boost. Can't really see well with the snowstorm. Don't forget your visibility gauge, Artyom. If you don't move too fast and don't come out into the light, you'll be harder for them to notice. Don't turn your flashlight on either, they could notice. Artyom, incoming two of them. I'll give you some cover from above. Thank you. 
Report your status. Group B, continue patrolling the courtyard in the generator room. Group A, check the wind turbine zone. Communications were lost there. Damn, how many guards do they have? Am I glad to see you here? 
Are you all right? I'm fine, thank you. All right. We don't have much time. They'll be back. I'll go to the engine. It should be ready now. You go up there and Come switch on, the Tim. turntable mechanism on. Yeah, and please, be careful. We can easily have the whole base on us. Artyom, turn the turntable on. Over, all group, to the hangar. Well, man, 
court martial for all of you. All right, everyone, shut up! I can't believe this. Just can't believe shit! So this is true? You're working for them? The bastards shot Artyom! Be quiet! They... How did you end up here? Ah, uh, it doesn't matter. You have no idea what you just stuck your heads in. We've no moves left. Hans, I can't take this line no, down. Shit, the water is No, him. I won't be quiet. What is this jammer for? Why are they hiding the fact that Moscow didn't survive alone? There, in the ravine, about, there are sir, people yes, from yes, other cities, dead. Yeah, All of them, women, up. children. I'll tell you all later. Everything. Gramps, what's going on out there, down this road? The road is fine, at least until a hundred click mark. Is there a safe place to stop nearby? Of course. We have to make haste, though. They called the cruiser. All right, gentlemen. Artyom and Anna have just made a huge mess, and I can't go back to Moscow now. The wartime legislation dictates they'd be killed. In any case, I have to get them out of town until it all blows over. But you all should stay. Hear me, Major? My people are in no way related it's to not my this call, and you're not. misunderstanding. Well, I'll jam. fight for the guys no matter what. Of course, Artyom, Anna, they are the with us. The no one behind. All right, Spartans, throw these overboard and pull him ahead. Come with me, Artyom. Let's catch them there. I'm so glad the boys supported us. It looks like my father didn't say a word to them about this either. We spent 20 years in Metro, thinking the rest of the world was burnt to a crisp in the war. But they just circled Moscow with those jammers, and we were none the wiser. How perfect of them! While you were getting irradiated on the surface, my father just kept lying! Lying to you, to me, to everyone! The whole fucking world! And not even batting an eye! Retirement with our lives, you damn cripple! Plans! Treason! 
We have served you people without question for years! We have spilled our blood for the cause! You sold out! They destroyed us and you! I have been a soldier my whole life! I have dedicated my life to my people, my country! But I'll be damned if I give it to parasites like you!
We stopped a hundred clicks from Moscow to check our